Hello and welcome to a very special installment of Renault's product review, coming at you straight from the 2018 Nuremberg Toy Fair. For those of you who don't know, my name is Brett, I'm the videographer at Renault's Euro Imports. Here at the Toy Fair, we have some amazing things to show you. Anything from toys, dolls, action figures, and of course what you came here to see, trains. Now join me for an exclusive look at everything we have to offer at the 2018 Nuremberg Toy Fair. Hi friends, you are here on the stand of Fulgurex in Switzerland, from Switzerland. I will present you one of our news, the Gauge 1 model A35 number 202. This locomotive is one of our farmers' locomotive from the Gotthard Bahn. Would say dated 1896, same as the train Gotthard Bahn from the Belle Epoch. This train was for the higher society as a little bit Orient Express in France. It's a little bit the same style. This locomotive was presented first in Geneva, 1896, in the exhibition Universal Mondial, as a little bit as technical highlight production in Switzerland. This locomotive was also in black color, a little bit later in the 20s. Same style as Gotthard Bahn. Here you will see the same locomotive, the A35, under production. You can see inside the cylinders of the locomotive. The A35 is of course a four-cylinder steam engine, one of the strongest steam engines in Switzerland. As I say before, it dates from the 1896 and it was a real construction made in Switzerland by the Swiss industry. Of course, the first time this locomotive was presented, the real one in Geneva, in the exhibition Universal Mondial, name it, and this was in the 1896. And the locomotive was presented of one of the shadow in Switzerland of technical industry production. Then, of course, the locomotive was in servicing over the Gotthard, crossing the line of the Gotthard steam mountain. And uh, it was, of course, a real success for the highest society with the Gotthard bound train. Here you will see any models for our O-Gage friends. We have here the prototype of the BLS. BLS is named Bern Lötschberg Simplon was one of the strongest electric locomotives and uh, not as the one before across the Gotthard, this one across the Simplen Montant. And uh, you will see one is Finnish in brown. Every BLS locomotive was in brown color. And the first one the, on the first floor is a prototype in brass. The painted model is named a Breda. Breda is made in Italy and Switzerland makes the copy of the same locomotive in the Swiss industry by Sechero. And this is the one here, non-painted. This model would be delivered about in springtime uh, this year, 2018. Okay, by Fulgurex you will find also smaller gauges, of course, than gauge 1 and O gauge. Here you see in HO our news product, and this is the Bugatti. Bugatti is a French streamlined locomotive, of course not really a locomotive, it's a coach, a streamlined coach. Uh, this streamlined coach was uh, powered by four Bugatti engines, Bugatti from the motor car, of course. It was in the 1930s, exactly 1937 was the first one for the ETA company, it's this one here. And then it was rebuilt and rebuilt of the years, just in the 1950s. The last one was SNCF, a French state railway, of course. And it was in circulation just end of the 60s. Same model you would have also in Couplage, Couplage is a double one, double Bugatti. Problem was always a space in this car, in this streamlined cars. This existed in PLM. PLM is named Paris Lyon Méditerranée, south of France, and then later in an SNCF version. 
same model would be available also in N-Gage later a bit. By Fulgurex of Switzerland you will find also Swiss stream cars, locomotives, etc. One of our newest creation in HO, it's the Jura file. It's a Aero Jura, what name it. This was only one uh, stream car who was built in the 1930s. Different modification was made just in the 70s, from light green, original color, to the dark green, typical Swiss locomotive. We built this model as a little bit a special model for 70 years of Fulgurex. In Switzerland it was a very big seller. Of course, light green is very special color, not the normal dark green as usual the Swiss train was. Unfortunately, this train is not existing here in Switzerland because it was breaked up and sold as parts in an auction. This was in 1971. Okay guys, that's all for today. Thank you for your visit in Switzerland. Of course, not really in Switzerland. You was in Germany and the Toy Fair show in Nuremberg exactly. I hope you had a pleasure here. Hope you have a pleasure outside from Switzerland. And I hope of course to see you next year on the same time. Thank you, have a good day.